Lily Faulkner. And I'm Brad McGee. And welcome to the second episode of Grammar TV for Semester 2. As we are starting the second semester of the year, Josh Miller and myself visited the Grade Sevens and asked about their experiences so far. We visited some Grade Sevens to find out their thoughts about grammar so far. We asked them if they had enjoyed their Grade Seven year. Uh, it's been okay, I guess. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty good. I've really enjoyed it. It's been an awesome opportunity to meet new people. I've made it like quite a few new friends and got to meet the teachers and been very supportive. Yeah. It's been very exciting for me because it's just been really fun. What their favourite subject is? Health, sport, because Mr. Watkey. Yeah. Um, I think I quite like maths because I just, I just enjoy all the numbers and things. Yeah. Who is their favourite teacher? Most of them said Mr. Watkey. Um, Mr. Watkey. <laughs> Mine would be Mrs. Button. And what subject they don't like? Probably science for me because it's hard. Probably history because I find it challenging and a bit boring. <laughs> Mine would probably be science because sometimes it gets a bit boring. The grade sevens have enjoyed their time at high school and they're looking forward to continuing their journey at grammar. This has been Josh Miller. Those grade sevens really seem to be enjoying themselves so far. They do, don't they? After the retirement of Maria Strickland, Sue has taken up the important role of canteen manager. Ben Hill and Miles Hurst caught up with her to see her ideas. We caught up with Sue, the new canteen manager, and she told us about what she likes about it here. That's good. Kids are really good. Staff are really friendly. Sue also told us about the new changes she has made. Pasta on a Thursday is now carbonara. Uh, your jack of potatoes come with bacon and sour cream and stuff now. Um, can't get pizza pockets anymore, so I've got pizza fingers. And yeah, making a few little changes as I go. She would also like it if you approached her for any new ideas. Go find out, you know, at the end of the day, if you students don't like what's on the menu, it's not much point me putting it on it. So, you know, communication and feedback from you guys is the key to it all. She's been doing a great job so far, don't you think? I really agree with you there, Brad. This term we have welcomed a number of new exchange students. Abby Billing, Lily Faulkner and Sophie Campbell went and spoke to the French exchange students about their time at grammar and their thoughts on Australia. My name is Nina and I'm 16. I'm Pierre and I'm 15. Um, I'm Lee and I'm 16. And I'm Alexander and I'm 15. Good day, mate. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> no. No, it's not that bad with the bread. Yeah, with toaster, it tastes like olive. <laughs> While the Sherbourne girls have been visiting grammar, they interviewed Mr. Webster and his grade 10 broadcasting class on some English knowledge. We thank the grade 10 class and the Sherbourne girls for this story. The Queen. Um, the, the big, big Ben. McLaren. <laughs> Beer. Rain. Sam Beckles. The Queen. Uh, pale people. <laughs> Tea. Biscuits. Ne um, biscuits? Uh, scones. <laughs> Fish and chips. Crumpets. <laughs> I don't know. Harry? Um, what is it? What's the baby called? George! George! Yeah, George, because George took Harry's spot. Oh, yeah. Prince... William and Kate. Is it Prince Harry? And... I don't know who it. Take two! Literally! The Queen. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know any... Ed Sheeran. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. No. Oh, 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 um, David Beckham. Um, Kate Middleton. How did you know that? Uh, Theresa May. Oh, God. Oh, no, I can't remember. <laughs> Daniel Cameron. Theresa May. Yay! Yeah! This has been the sixth episode of Grammar TV for 2017. I'm Brad. And no, I'm Lily. And, and we'll, we'll see, see you, you next time. time.